The chief Betsy is in Florida tonight. She's on the Space Coast with a look at the latest technology going into the Armitus One rocket. Russ, we were so lucky to be invited here to Kennedy Space Center to check out the Artemis One rocket. It's in that vehicle assembly building right now. It's been nearly 20 years in the making, and to see this thing stacked is just incredible. 322 feet tall, 50 million pounds will be rolling out to 39B. That's the historic launch pad here at Cape Canaveral, where early in 2022, this rocket will be lifting off to start a whole new chapter in American human space exploration. Space is hard, uh, but we are going to the moon with humans in 2023. Look at all the testing that's done in the vacuums at Glenn and the other testing equipment here that allows us to replicate the conditions in space. That is why these testing facilities at Glenn and here at Armstrong are so important. We've been following this project for two years now, kind of getting ahead when the Orion space capsule came to Sandusky. Well, we're going to continue to follow this program, of course, all the way into early 22 when this launch is expected to take place. We have all of the coverage we've done at WKYC.com. Additionally, I have more of today's behind the scenes uh, at my Instagram account, at Betsy Kling. Live from the Space Coast, Betsy Kling, 3 News.